Hey guys, in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to check the alternator voltage and how much the voltage should be, okay? Before you replace your alternator, you do need to check the voltage. All you need is a voltmeter. Right now, if we can see, we have about, if the connection does now, okay, my connection move. The battery power is right now 1256, okay? That's normal voltage. So we're gonna do a couple of different ways, not just one way, okay? We're gonna check the voltage and uh, directly from the alternator over there, battery, and we're gonna use the ground of the body. So, you do need to check it, but I'm gonna show you, okay? Fairly good voltage on this alternator, and the battery looks good, so let's check this out. Okay, so I got my car running. And look at the voltage I got. That looks, well, my connection loses up. If you look at right there, 14. Anything above 14 is pretty good. So there you have it. That's how much voltage you should, your alternator should be putting out. But there's a lot of questions. I'm gonna bring the camera closer and I'm gonna show you a few things. All right, now we're gonna take it up close and personal look, okay? So, right here, you have a, uh, be careful with your hands, don't hurt yourself. And this muffler is hot, there's catalytic converter. So let's pop this open right here. Okay, right here is a live power, okay? So as you can see directly onto the battery here, positive, negative, and we have 14.40. Okay, one thing I wanna tell you is, do try to check it in different places. Try to get it on top of the terminal here. Try to get it here. Because sometimes the contact between the terminal won't be good. So what we're gonna do here is, I'm gonna try to manage to put this here. We're gonna take the positive. We're gonna take the positive. Oh, let me see if I can unwind this. Oh, am I winding it? Crazy me. Okay, let's take this apart. The positive stays here. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take this positive and put it right here. If I could get a good connection. I'm sorry, the negative on the battery. And the other side, we're gonna put it directly on, try not to put it here, cause you see this is painted a little bit. But if you get a good contact here, look at that. Pretty good. Okay, also what we're gonna do is, you can take this, you can put this somewhere on the engine block. So let me, I'm gonna have to try to work here on some magic, cause I only got one hand here. You see that? 1451 into the block. I got a negative right there and a positive here. So do a couple of checkpoints, okay? This car does have this battery sense. Sometimes this goes off. Make sure you push this. I had a one car, I had to put a zip tie because the connector was no good. It kept on coming back. But anyways, there you have it. Thank you for watching. And don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to push this back once you're done, okay? Thank you and bye-bye.